Hey guys, it's HammyGirls3114 and today I'm going to be doing a requested video by Wolves and Cats 100. The request is Hamsters Daily Needs. So this is kind of like my daily routine video except I'm going to be kind of explaining some other stuff and it's going to be a little bit more in detail. So whether that is putting it in a playpen, putting it in a hamster ball, holding it, let it run around on your lap, whatever. You have to do something to interact with it. Um, it is a rumor that if you don't like handle your hamster for a really long time, they can become untamed. Um, I don't exactly support it, but I kind of support it. I'm kind of neutral on that. But it is a bit true that if you don't hold your hamster and you don't handle it or interact with it, it won't know you as much. So it may be afraid of you and it may become untamed, I guess. But it is also a rumor because um, I really don't have personal experience with that, but some people have. I don't really know. So you need to make sure that your hamster has fresh water every day. I don't um, replace my hamster's water every day. I replace it every other day. Um, I do fill my hamster's water bottle up all the way to the top, but that's just the type of water bottle I have. It has to do with the air pressure so it doesn't leak. Um, but you don't have to fill it all the way up to the top. I recommend doing that because then you can monitor to see how much water your hamster drinks. Um, so like if it's filled all the way to the top and it, um, drank like that much, then you can see, oh, it drank that much and that, and you're going to be able to see that. And you can see if there's any symptoms of any sickness or anything if you do that. Hamsters do need a fresh supply of water, so um, I wouldn't ch I wouldn't um, leave the water in your hamster's water bottle um, for more than like two or three days because the water does become uh, it's, it wouldn't be fresh anymore, and water does become kind of a bit like not as clean and not as fresh and your hamster does like a clean fresh supply of water and if your hamster isn't drinking from its water bottle or you haven't noticed any of the water um disappearing that may be because um the water bottle isn't working or if your hamster is drinking a lot of water like not a normal amount like if it's drinking like this much you know filled up from the top your water bottle may be leaking so to test to make sure that your water bottle is working, I have mentioned this before. Hello, Jewel. Hey, Jewel. Hello there. Okay, so to test if your water bottle is working, um, you should touch the bottom of the nozzle of the water bottle. And if water comes out on your finger, that means that it's working and your hamster does have access to their water bottle. Hey, Jewel. Hamsters need a um, a healthy diet, so you should replace your hamster seed mix um, every other day or every two days if you want. Your hamster will not eat all of its food um, right away. So, like when you give your hamster food, it may like eat like or oh, it may seem like it's eating all of the hamster food. Um, if it does eat all of it, it's not actually eating it. It's just stuffing the food in its cheek pouches and it's putting it in its food stash somewhere so they can eat it later. Because hamsters only eat when they want to. So, by giving them a dish, um, they can just have a constant supply. So then they can just take that food and then put it in its stash. Um, another thing is that your hamster should always have um, vegetables. Well, not every day, but... Um, it should be pretty often that you give your hamster vegetables because it has a lot of vitamins in it because your hamster's diet doesn't supply all of the vitamins and minerals and the calcium that your hamster needs. So if you need to know um, some safe fruits and vegetables for your hamster, I have the list down below in the description bar or you can check it out on my website. I will be doing an updated version on that, like the... Um, oh, where are you going? The, um, updated version on foods that are safe for your dwarf hamster. So, the 
next thing is treats. So you shouldn't really be giving your hamster treats every day. It's not like a necessary essential daily need thing, but it is pretty helpful for you to give your hamster treats. I give my hamster treats um, whenever they do something good, um, whenever they make you happy, or just every once in a while. Um, I recommend giving them sunflower seeds, but not too many. Also, if they have sunflower seeds in their diet, I wouldn't give them any sunflower seeds. Um, I also recommend dried banana chips. Uh, it's KT Healthy Toppings Dried Banana. And the last one I recommend is KT Healthy Toppings Papaya. These are just dried fruit with some um, food coloring in it. There's no added sugar or anything. It's just food coloring and dried fruit. Um, you can also give your hamsters uh, milk bones. These are actual milk bones. Um, they're unflavored. You could basically give your hamster any type of dog treat as long as there's no onion or garlic or powder, onion garlic powder in it because that is really unsafe for your hamster. And I just got two of those. They had some in their cage, but they already ate them. Dog bones are really good for your hamster's teeth because they'll help wear it down. Um, this next thing isn't really a daily need, but it is pretty important. You should make sure that you clean your hamster's cage at least once a week. If your hamster's cage is really big, like mine, um, you can clean it about every two weeks because it doesn't really get smelly. But depending on how much your hamster um, goes to the bathroom and in your cage, you might want a spot clean, which is where you just go through their bedding or like go through their hidey house and get rid of all of their poop and you may want to change their um their nesting material because sometimes that does have a lot of poop and pee on it so you just want to change it up to make sure that they're um, sleeping with some sanitary stuff so that is basically all the daily needs that i can really think of um basically just play with your hamster interact with it give it fresh um, water, give your hamster um, new food every other day, and don't forget to clean your hamster's cage. So yeah, that is hamster's daily needs, and if you have any questions about it or you think I should have mentioned some more stuff, just put it in the just, or comments below. Um, thanks for watching. Comment, rate, and subscribe. Bye!